All right. So tomorrow morning starts my new regimen. I was just getting all my starting weights, and I kind of just had everything set up. I figured I'd shoot my little uh, home gym. It's not a garage. It's a thing. It's a concrete slab with an awning. So hex squat, uh, hex bar for deadlifts. I totally dig this. This is this is so much better for me than deadlifting and you know the regular bar. Much better for my posture. Uh, it's kind of fun. It's actually really fun. So there's my starting weight on that. I think is whatever, hundred something, uh, hundred fifty-two. Yeah, something like that. One hundred fifty-two, I think. Um, here are two attachments, which which I just left them both on. They won't both be on at the same time. This is the Gronk Fitness uh, T bar. This thing is so great because um, again, you know, having a having a a home gym, that's kind of always the, the trick is the back workouts because, you know, you don't have like proper lat pulls. You don't have big rowing machines. All that stuff's kind of... Anyway, so that is what this is for, T-barring. And then here, this is what's known, and it's pink, as a Viking bar. And this is for like overhead pressing with the landmine. And you can also do like thrusters it's amazing i figured out the exact weights of all this stuff and kind of went from there um this is just a little cheapy fitness gear bar with the landmine we've got the ethos power rack 2.0 um which i really like i really actually love um and it's got the you know the feet the legs the bottom so it's it's nice you don't you can put it in in uh, unstable environments and not uh, not drill it into the ground. See, so like here, you can see it's you know, I've chucked it with wood. And then from here, I, I, I work on the outside of this. I, I've kind of gone through the different things using the the pins and working on the inside. I, I kind of just like doing the outside. Here's where we can do bench, incline press, squatting, overhead press. You know, kind of anything you'd need from the rack in the front, you do here. Um, got a couple of bands for where I work. I do those every morning with my shoulder to loosen it up. I got two thick bands. With the two thick bands, I'm able to rep out pull-ups. That's my 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 uh, goal for the summer is to get my pull-up thing happening. So this is a part of every day's workout is pull-ups. Um, I've also got. TRX in the middle. I put 60 pound dumbbells on the back too. So, I mean, this thing's not going anywhere. You can, yeah, this is fine. You can do TRX off of it. And then I've got the Spud Inc. pulley system. And this is mostly, we do mostly rowing and some, some tricep pushdowns. And what you do is you take this bench, flip it the other way, set it on the incline, pull the bar towards you, and you, you put your feet up on here like a holster and you get the right angle and it's actually like pretty much exactly like a low row and uh yeah it's, it's really cool it's really cool really really good the heavy bag my old fitness gear uh bench you still use it just you know you, you don't want to be over here getting heavy and, well not heavy but you know doing it and using that Daily kettlebell swings. That's a 44-pound kettlebell swing, 44-pound 40, kettlebell. And we've got dumbbells from basically 5 pounds up to 60. These are all the fraction plates, 5 pounds, 2 and a half. This, you know, like an ab mat. And this is like a little, kind of our little whiteboard. I've got all the, the weights of the, or the, the weights of the different bars now because I've been figuring everything out. And some PVC pipes for uh, for warming up. These are the pins that come with the rack for the inside, but I just don't use them. It's not my thing. In here, I've got the the wraps or holsters for hanging leg raises, hanging knee raises. That is starting as a part of a daily thing too. We're gonna get that going on tools and junk and then you know different attachments and collars and you know slingshot all that stuff and then this is where it fills up with the weights um i've got a bunch of rogue 
like high temp bumper plates. Um, I've got a bunch of the ethos plates and then I've got a couple of these old fitness gear metal ones which are actually coming in handy because on some of this t-bar stuff wheels are so strong you know that those are half the thickness of, of like the thor the 45 pound bumper so we can stack those up and it gets heavy and I also use them with side bends so that's kind of the whole deal in the house we've got a well, I think I shot a little video. We'll cut it in right now. So this is the house portion of the video. And there it is. These two have been big. And um, the yoga mat, these three actually. I'm working on some range of motion and some achy old bones. And then this thing, the Bowflex Max Trainer. That's Bowflex. That's Bowflex Max Trainer. Um, I love this thing. You know, <laughs> this thing is so hard and so humbling. But I've been using it the last few days, and I'm actually, there's hope for me. And I think it's because of Orange Theory, all the running on the treadmill, and, you know, the, the, the spin bike and all that stuff. Like, it's, this is not impossible. So there you go. And there you go. So this is this has been a work in progress over like maybe the last, I don't know, six years. I, I kind of start, well, I kind of started this a little bit in LA. I, I had stuff in my apartment. And then when we got a house, I think we started doing stuff. And then, then really when I got to North Carolina, I, I really got, got into it. And then, you know, obviously people know my story. I, Put on a hundred pounds and lost my mind. And then in the in the in the in the uh, efforts of getting my life back, I've really gotten into this whole fitness thing. And these guys are into it. Let's show. Run a route. Do a crossing route. Okay. Say hi. Oh, almost. They're getting better. They bought baseball stuff today, and we've got the basketball hoop. They're really into the, the football, though. That's, that's, we, we play every day. We play snag. We run routes. We didn't play. We don't do routes every day, but Jake does the routes. Say hi. Oh, almost. Almost. He's getting better. He's getting better. My beautiful wife. We've been going to Orange Theory together. And there it is. Oh, so I put the mats down here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's good. That'll be better. You couldn't like really superset back and forth. I get. Well, you could. Oh yeah, because your feet. You, you, we we'd pull the pads like this. Come to help. Okay. Want to try a little superset, Momotone? Yeah. 